Hi guys, it's Intity3000. Um, sorry about the last video, I just got mega pissed. Um, because the freaking ballast. But now I've overcome it, and I've actually done something about it. So, you've probably seen it earlier, it was a whole mess. And I've now got, basically, my m it was sort of my mum's fault. She brought me two glues, and she left one in the sun, and one in the shade. And the one in the sun obviously got the... This one I use and it went all friendly. But this one is perfect. So I've managed to do all the bushes around this corner, except from there, because the amount of ballast I wasted. It's un look, I can do all that. <laughs> so yeah, um, yeah. So over here, I have done some static grass and bashed it all up there. Um, uh, hopefully I'll ask my dad in the week to give me some more balance and grass because I am on the loose but anyway um whistle sign bushes more bushes uh a field full of sheep and a tree a signal a home signal I don't know if, I don't know if it's LMS something and I've added some weeds and stuff for the ballast uh you're probably saying oh it's all over the sleepers well once it's dried hard it's going to be easier to get off if you think about it and so I've just done all this and I've done um, I've done this area now so it's all grass, I mean bushes and there's a tree and I've just done the rim of it so it looks a bit more natural now and then it's going to have the um, um, um the uh, I can find them yeah this buffet in city coach and this normal winter city coach because I can't be asked to get the Batman restaurant cars. But anyway, hopefully, when I get a tenner next, I'm gonna buy another Dapol coach and paint it up in the green livery. Um, um, cross country 170. Um, I said to him, I'll sell him these two coaches, but I'm thinking about that at the moment just in case I want them still. Um, yeah, nothing much. I've just had a massive sort out, to be quite honest. So it was absolutely getting really bad. Um, so, yeah. Um, also, my Jane and the steam wagon have gone to be overhauled by my dad's mate's grand... No, father. So, yeah. That's going to be good when they come back. And I should be getting some run running videos of those. I mean, that would be quite interesting, I think. So yeah, um, also I've taken the fencing off for a minute because my dad says, oh it has to be green or black, I'm like, it could be white car in it, a great western has white fences, so like, no, you look ineffective, so yeah, um, I'm going to have to go with them, that one and paint them green, I'm obviously going to get more passengers, so don't worry if you, I'm doing your name, so I will do your name, um, I'm going to weather the track in a nice cold black, um, so over here I'm going to have uh, the coal like bunker things full of coal. We have a digger, and I get the Dapole 4MT um, Mongrel class model. Do it all up, and it's being loaded with coal there and there. It's gonna be like a wagon, and I'm gonna have people painting it. So yeah, I'm gonna get the, the um, I'm gonna get the uh, old Batman maintenance men. Actually, over here, if I can find it. Is this just, oh yeah, this is most of the things I was going to get, but if I can find it, it's this basically, and the maintenance man, and I get the locomotive stuff, and that's what I'm going to get, coal shrinks, and I don't know, dap holes, digger, um, I don't know, I'm going to get the detail part, but the back one, not the hornby, um, I was going to get that, but I don't need that now, uh, black five, from Batman, the uh, 4MT by Batman and the Jinty by Batman. Now, in the model shop I normally go to, there is a Hornby one. I don't care about. I don't really care about the detail models anymore. I just want. I just want the loco. So I'm gonna get the Hornby one, and that's about about 20 quid instead of like um, 104 pound. I've seen this one. I haven't seen this one yet. So hopefully I'll look out for that one. And this I've seen in the model shop for 25 quid. So yeah, um, the 33, my one broke, 
It, I forget, you haven't heard the story, that blue one, it basically caught on fire. Well, it didn't catch on fire, it just, like, the smoke started coming from it, and it actually melted the hole inside. You can tell by the windows what happened. So I had to repaint it, because it did look ugly. It looked like turned black. So yeah, I painted that livery, if you haven't seen that. And same thing kind of happened this, but the body didn't get affected. So yeah, um, now also, um, I'm probably waffling this now. So this is my E2 tank. Now, um, you probably noticed I have I do loads of kit. I mean, um, I mean, what trains like this one, that one, that one, that one. Sorry, uh, that one, and the coaches and the wagons. Now, um, I might put some on tour. So like, I know they visit any of your railways. So I'm not gonna say it's a yes yet, but I'm gonna think about it because like, if you break it or it gets lost in the post, you know, I've kind of lost the lo loco. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe and comment, and um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Bye.